My name is Asim Kindra. I'm an associate professor at the Department of Operations Management here at CBS. I'm also the academic head of the Graduate Diploma Program in Supply Chain Management. So our program is one of the oldest SEM programs in Denmark and our roots go all the way back to NHD in logistics. Uh, and if I may, uh, we are known for three things. Uh, one is academic competence, student performance uh, and recommendability amongst our students. Amongst other things, you learn how to do process mapping, value chain analysis, lean analysis, but also how to develop value chain strategies and uh, production techniques uh, and production management, how to structure production uh, systems. At a general level, you also learn how to design and manage your distribution network, distribution systems, uh, and then also how to manage your procurement uh, and, and your relationships with your suppliers. So, how do we ensure relevance? Uh, well, we ensure relevance uh, by including you uh, and your in your profession and your in your company as business cases. Uh, we simulate the conditions that you face in your jobs on a daily day basis, uh, and this is what it makes it applied. So, we believe in the deployment of learning modes, methods, and media that 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 provide maximum uh, flexibility to the students and yet enhance learning. So traditionally teaching has taken place uh, during weekdays, in the evenings, after work, uh, between 6 and 8 for example, uh, on Mondays and Wednesdays. But now, uh, to even induce more flexibility into the teaching, we have introduced blended learning and weekly teaching. So blended learning involves the use of traditional classroom teaching elements with online teaching elements and uh, it helps in induced flexibility. Weekend teaching, on the other hand, is teaching uh, on, in the weekend, on Saturdays typically, uh, and that also helps induce flexibility, in, but also outreach uh, into the program. Solving important challenges requires time and focus, uh, but also motivation for you to do this. So the organization gets an opportunity to, to solve these important challenges through the course of the program. This is one thing that uh, which they would not have had the time to focus on in daily routine. And there are other benefits as well. Uh, for example, there could be positive benefits for your co-employees, for your fellow workers, uh, and you, and in terms of delegation of responsibilities too. So, in my opinion, your organization would get a motivated employee uh, after this, uh, uh, one who's uh, upgraded his or her supply chain management skills and competences. So the people that we normally attract are professionals who are bent towards production, logistics and supply functions. And they, they might be employed already, uh, they have experience in a lot of cases and also all the way up to 5 to 10 years of experience and they work as either production managers or analysts or planners. So if you're interested in value chains, uh, in supply chains, in the coordination and management techniques that help you manage these value chains and supply chains, then you should come and join us. Thank you.